Okay, that pretty much covers virtual memory. There's a few takeaways from this section. First off, make sure you understand how virtual memory works in today's computing systems. You'll be asked that on the exam. Also, pay attention to the fact that the CPU does a lot more than just execute code. This leaves openings for attackers to attack the CPU, so we need to understand what it's doing so we can defend the CPU from those attacks. Also, pay attention to the different types of memory. For RAM, make sure you understand the difference between dynamic and static RAM. And for ROM, make sure you're comfortable with the different types of ROM. If you cover all these topics, you'll be better prepared to take the exam.